The U.S. market will be out in observance of the Juneteenth national holiday and trading conditions will be thinner for the remainder of the day as a consequence. What little price action we have seen on this Monday has been risk off in nature, mostly on the back of an ongoing hawkish message out from Fed officials that has been in conflict with market pricing. But we've also seen risk off flow on worry around the China growth outlook after Goldman Sachs cut its Q2 China GDP forecast. And so U.S. equity futures are showing signs of wanting to reverse lower while the US dollar is back in demand. Over in the UK, the pound has done a good job holding up just off yearly highs despite all of this US dollar demand. This as the UK two-year yield rises above 5% for the first time since 2008. Looking ahead, we get some ECB speak US NHB housing and Canada producer prices. That's all for now.